uh, it's it's taken us all by surprise. Um, yeah. I mean, it's the whole mindfulness thing is um, is, is taking off. Um, I mean, bookshelves are bookshops are just full of mindfulness books at the moment, and uh, yeah, it's great because it offers us all a way out of uh, anxiety, stress, and depression. Yeah, without any dr- drugs or downside, it's a pretty happy oh, scenario, right. really. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, the book is is based around uh, what's known as mindfulness based cognitive therapy, which is essentially is is a form of uh, mindfulness meditation, which is the oldest form of meditation, with just a light twist of uh, cognitive behavioural therapy thrown in. Now that sounds very heavy, but what it comes down to is. 10 to 20 minutes of mindfulness meditation per day and when they've done clinical trials uh, well six major international clinical trials have shown that um, mindfulness based cognitive therapy is at least as good as drugs for uh, for, for for depression and I it works that great book. that's amazing yeah it's it is and it's uh, it's it's also one of the preferred treatments recommended by the uh, UK's National Institute for Health and Clinical Excellence and NICE is um, they assess all of the treatments that are used in our National Health Service to see just how effective they are so that the drug companies can't uh, you know sell us dodgy pills to be <laughs> that's yeah. that's the end of it. and uh, you know they, they they recommend it because it's at least as good as the as drug treatments 